look at this, right? What'd that say? I done made 24,000 just from a certain group, man. If you all good picks, man, we going straight green, 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 green. But, you know what I'm saying? All the plays that we do play that go green, it's for big amounts, you feel me? Like, my drink, like bro, I'm going to show it to y'all again. My winning amount says 24,000, bro. And that, that's no cap. Like, bro, I'm in the app, bro. I can close the app, right? And go back into it. 24,000. Welcome back to another video. You already know what time it is. You already know the vibes. We back with another video. Make sure you smash that like button. Bless the like button for me ski right now. I really would appreciate that. You feel me? Anyway, we back with another cut. Back with another vibe. So, client came in. And Brody, Brody was looking rough. You feel me? So, he came to get that crispy holiday season vibe. So, he could take any one of y'all, you feel me, y'all females. Uh, that just is what it is. You know what I'm saying? After you get a haircut, that's just how you feel. You feel like you could do that. So we go ahead, prep the lining. Then we go ahead, get our trimmer out. We trim that lining perfectly. As you can tell, as the trimmer is actually pretty much being pressed by the hair, you see a white line. The white line is typically because the clippers and the hairline was prepped perfectly and correctly so that's why you also get these lining these uh white lines you can also do them like with chalk but it don't come out as definite as like basically if you push your finger on it press it wet it it'll come off but if you do it like this it's more liable to stay you feel me because you actually really prepped it and correctly aligned everything perfectly to make these white lines and to make your the haircut pop pretty much but as you see we're doing a phase on the side so he go low fade on the side mid fade at the bike and obviously wavelength as far as measurements which is typically like a 1 1.5 1.6 uh depending on hair texture and yes sir ski like overall this right here, man, is that one. A lot of people, they get mad. They be like, dang, 250 for a haircut. But it's like, you'll spend 250 on some shoes. You feel me? I mean, that, that probably comparison was trash. But at the end of the day, I'm basically saying somebody got a price. You know what I'm saying? Because somebody might think, yo, $250 shoes is crazy. You feel me? Because you got $20 haircuts, $50 haircuts. So you got $20 shoes, $40 shoes. But it's all preference. So at the end of the day, my analogy wasn't too far off. Y'all let me know how this cut came out. Ready one through ten. Ten being amazing. One being you should have wanted somebody else. You know who sliced it.